good day and welcome. We're going to be playing some Gremlins Incorporated. Now, I do really like this board game, and I've played it a lot, and I kind of took a break from a while. Um, usually I only play online ranking games. Uh, I guess uh, the best way to explain it is just explain it as we go. Um, there's a lot to the game. It's simple, but complex, and it's a bit of a backstabby game. You spend a lot of your time backstabbing. So I'm going to go right into the multiplayer right now. Uh, I would play a single player, but it's no fun because everybody's after you because their whole goal is to try and stop you before too long. So we put on the rank session. While we wait, I'll explain as much as I can. So every game requires a certain amount of points to win. Now here you'll see that this shows what each game's point requirements are. Now when I play ranked matches, they're always 30 points. That's how it goes. And there's a time limit on your turn, so that you know you don't have those people procrastinating all day and making the game go longer. Though it still happens, you just not as long as it could be. Um, these will indicate the different things that are turned on that you can see or not see in the game. None of this really matters right now because I'm only almost only going to play ranked games unless we get a bunch of people that want to add me on the friends list and want to play these board games that I'm playing then, you know, we'll worry about it then, and you'll figure it out. The rules are quite simple. Uh, every time you come in first or second, or first it is, I can't remember, win three rank sessions to claim yet. So if you win, you get one of these chests. I, get, I just need another one to get in there. It's hard to win. It's a lot of, uh, if you're doing good, everyone's out to get you, right? So, let's see. We're going to need at least four people for a game, and then they're going to, of course, rank you, put you in based on your rank, right? Um, now you get cards, this is how you make your points, and there are several key locations, they're bigger than the rest, and each card has a location in the corner of it, so that card can be played in that location if you meet the requirements, either enough cash or enough votes you can spend, etc. And the cards can do anything from give you points, to give you gold, give you malice, give you votes, etc. And we'll explain when you can see some of these things in the game better. Um, each location has their own special things that you can do as well if, you, if you're on there. So, like, uh, there's a bank and every time you land on the bank, you can pay to increase your income by 10. So every time you land on an income spot, you get an extra 10 points. Um, stuff like that. Jail is a very interesting uh, place to go. You can win the game just staying in jail. You raise your uh, rank up in the jail from like a novice all the way up to the dawn, and then every time you make points in there, you or every time you like get jail rep, you get a point, which could be useful near the end game. Now, if you're the thief, you already start off pretty high up, and there are different classes. I wonder if I can find them while we're waiting here. We're up to four people in queue, but it doesn't seem to be getting anywhere. So go in here. Let's go uh, characters. So we'll look at the 12 characters that we have to choose from. We have the Engineer. Now, the Engineer get one. You start with one point at the start of the session, so you get a leg up already. Every time you visit a plant, you get 50 coins. Golden Thumb. When you play cards that give you five or more, get an extra point, which is definitely handy. He can definitely climb up there, right? And they got different masks for them, but I'm not paying for the DLC. Um, trade Union. When this character participates in the session, all players earn 100 coins instead of 50 when using the plant. It's not bad. Now, we go on to the next guy. He is the politician. He starts off in this location here on the map. Loyal electorate. Get five votes at the start of the session, which doesn't hurt. The Astral Plane Club, which is this, when resting in the Astral Plane, get five cards to choose from instead of three, and lose three malice instead of two. Uh, it's very rare that people will skip a turn to get things. Oh, look, we get to start the game. Let's go in. We won't visit all the characters. We may point out the ones that are in the game, but you never know how long it's going to take to get into one, right? Now, right now, we only have 107 players on, so... Ooh, I'm going to take the Thief again, um, because that's what I want to do. I want to try and do a Jail Victory. I came so close last time I played it, and I did make the recording, but it was going on so long, and it was so late, and I was tired. So let's take a look. So now I start in the Jail. Um, I think I'll keep this card. You know what? 
we'll throw that one away. We'll throw that one away. And there we go. And we'll see what we get. Now I'm going to say hello to everyone. Um, hello there. There we go. So I start off in jail. It's a fun place to start, but I'm not in jail. I just start there and I get to move through. And of course, I get the fun part. These are uh, misfortune spots. And if you go past one, then this misfortune happens, right? So this one here, every player loses half their money. Yay, a way to start the game, right? If I land on it, then I get to pick a player who's going to go after me. And you can see where it says right here, this is the target goal. This is everyone's points. Here's your coins. Here's your votes. And here's your malice. Now, the person with the least amount of malice will be blue, and they get an automatic not seeing three votes, which helps. And if you're the one with the most malice, malice you get a red lit-up icon here. Now, it's my turn, so we want to play. Now, I've got a one-by-chance. I do have a one-by-chance, but I don't want to use it. Um, we're going to go straight to the police. Um, let's go. Let's go to the police. Make everyone lose half their coins. Ooh, and I get plus one of the malice. Alright. Now, do I want to pay the bribe? No, I want to actually go to jail, so I'm hoping to roll a one. So, now, I am the most hated person on the board, and everyone is the most liked and tied for the most votes. Uh, this tells you if you're the richest or poorest or just average. Like, he's poor, he's the richest right now. Uh, if these people are all tied for the most votes. You can't see their imaginary three votes, but if you highlight over this, it tells you how that works. This is our income. Income is 30 right now, so every time I cross one of these things, I get 30 coins. If I land on it, you get double the coins. This is my bribe amount. So, this is going to be equal to 20 plus whatever this is. So the higher that gets, the worse it's going to be. And bribes are these ones here. So every time you land on one of these, you must pay the bribe. So you can imagine how dangerous this is. But there is an election every 20 turns or so, and I believe that can be moved forward. Now, what do I got? I definitely don't know here. There's not a whole lot. Um, I'm actually going to go up here. I'm going to go here. And I'm going to use this card here. And I also mentioned they have dice numbers on it, so you use the cards to move as two. So you got to choose. Do you want to save the card? Or do you want to use it to move? Ooh, so close to going to jail. But I don't mind not going to jail at the beginning because my goal for the first few turns is to hit this place as often as I can, raise up my income. And it doesn't hurt that I have some uh, criminal cards. And every time I play a criminal card, I get a point. <laughs> uh, gray cards are your secret cards. If you click on these, it tells you what this is, what they do when you play them. This one here, player of your choice, pays you 250. An independent auditor visits without warning. Everyone pays their bribes. Ooh, 21 coins out my bank account. Look at this guy here, though. The gambler, he's making his money, man. Okay, I want to get here, but do I have a two by chance? I do have a two. So I'm going to roll that uh, two. Get my double coins. And then I'm going to go up to the bank. Now, the thing is... To, I confused me when I started the game is I noticed that I could play any number card and just stop at any place, but I was always going for these. So if I play this card, I can choose it to use to go here. But for any of these other places, you have to land specifically on that. There are two different boards as well. There's one that's kind of more linear. I like this one better. I mean, they're still all a hot mess. So, I'm always going to play this one first. I get my extra money. I get my hate. Who cares about that? I get my point. Now, the day office, what are we doing this one? I can't get that, and you can play another office card. Oh, if I had another office card, and I might get one by then. So, I'm going to go here. Um... I'm not going to play that. I don't, can't afford it, and it gets me there. I'm going to play that. Oh, and yes, I'll pay that and increase my uh, stuff there. I just got an achievement, too. Robbery of the Century. Nice. I like the little emoticons, too. <laughs> They're fun. They add a little life to the game. And one of the things I like, too, it doesn't tell you. It just tells you the class of the character. You don't get to see their names until they're done. Uh, 
Yeah, I'll discard that card. I'm going to jail. And that's where I say thanks. And the jail I went. Just where I want to spend a lot of my game. They will learn quickly that I will never be upset with them sending me to jail. For most other people, it might suck. And I'm okay with bribing the cops to send other people to jail. Do I want to be bad, neutral, or good? Well, I'm going to be bad, because that gives me a point here. I choose one of my cards. What's one? No, thanks. I want to gain. No, thanks. Oh, I get to discard a card. I'm going to discard that one. Okay. Hey, that's not a bad one. I can get eight votes and stuff. I just have to make it through here and lose all my cash. It's all good. So let's see what these guys are doing. We've been kind of paying attention and explaining how the game works. We're going to see what these guys do. And you can follow along down here what they've played and what's going on. So he used that card to move. He's thinking now. He, he paid the insurance. Now you can pay the insurance on here just to not get a misfortune. I don't bother paying. It's a one out of six. Yeah, I'll do that. There we go. Take some cash. Stay in jail. Try to build my rep up, man. My street cred. Prison cred? I don't know how it works. You even sell a downloadable, printable version of the game. I suppose you could just print your own, I guess. But uh, it's like six bucks or something. This would be an interesting game to play with people around the table. We can actually see them laying down their cards. I don't tend to worry too much what they're doing. I try and pay attention to what's happened to me, though. So, Well, I'm going to act bad. See, I'm building it up here. See, I'm three in here. I'm looking for stuff that will give me that. No, that's no good. Yeah, that's what we do. There we go. Plus two. We're building up our cred. Quickly. we only been in jail one turn. We're doing pretty damn well. we almost going to make it to the next level. Now, you can do this. I believe that's jail statistics. It shows you everyone. They're all novices, man. I'm a thug, and I'm working on right-hand man. Just need three more. Oh, and if you land on the same square as another player, not counting one of these house icon ones, well... Yeah, how's this work? Now, this is framed. I get this opponent of your choice. It's a misfortune. Choose one of two. All right. So we're going to go here, actually. And we're going to walk to the prison, collect our cash along the way. Oh, minus 20 coins and minus one of those. Darn. Pay the bribe. No, roll a one, roll a one, roll a one. Oh. Usually I don't want to go to jail. <laughs> But I don't always get the option of the thief, so. Alright, what's the popper up to here? Uh, he's going along. I wonder if he's going this way or that way. That's what I don't like about this spot. You don't know, man. What's he gonna get? Oh, three points. That brings him up to four. Not good. Not good for me. All right. He got 60 more coins. My turn. Where are we going? Okay. Well, we've got that. Ooh, I'd love to get around to there. Um, can we get to here? Yeah, I can. So we can use a day at the office to get there. Pay that. That. We're going to use this. I don't... Um, I select him, why not? So we got uh, minus 10 income, minus one of those. Yeah, okay. Bam. Calm down, Sparky. Lose a point. <laughs> so mean. So, so mean. Now, what do I need to get my next destination? I need. One, two, three, four, five. Do I have a five? I do have a five. I want to use it myself, but I will use it to go get this point. Oh, I'm going to so totally use that on somebody. All right. You know, I feel like I should get go for that, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. Try not to be too, too evil. My f All right. So 
So my goal is I want to try and get here and use this, and then try and get over here and use this and make somebody lose some points. But it's better if they have points, so... Well, I think I'll do this. Select a player. Oh, that was rough. He got down to one point. I'm such a B. How dare I do that? I should have probably read that. I couldn't remember what the card did. I just knew that was going to give me a point. Do something negative, somebody else. Apparently, it's moved two points. <laughs> He's getting too high for for the start of the game, man. All right. Do we have a two? I would take a two. Yeah, we got two. Let's go land down here. Take some money. All right. I'm the richest man. We got to take down the coins. The gambler, though, he's got too many coins for my liking. 600, 598 coins, but he paid a bribe. All right. Can I get the votes though? Probably not. Ooh, can I get over here? I got enough coins. I want to get over here now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, it's a lot of moving. Um, I was going to use this, but let's use this indulgences. Um, we're going to go up here, take our chances, pay some bribes along the way. No, we won't. We'll risk it. Alright. Look at this guy with his five points. I should have gone over there and made him lose his five points. I'll get to him, don't you worry. I'm gonna keep that card. Ooh, but I gotta use this point. Oh. Go to jail. Meow. Go to jail. Now, I just need to go up three to two play this card. I didn't even expect to get this one. Get 50 when you play a card that gives you that. And I want to do that because that's money in the bank. But there's a misfortune. What is this misfortune? I can live with that, man. Come on. Get me here. I'll use that easy gamble. I'll get up. I'll play that. This is a permanent card, right? you got these guys got permanent cards. His is, uh, what is it? You have 50% chance of avoiding the bribes. Nice. So anyway, we're going to go up here. We're going to spend our gamble. Oh, no! And I play this. Oh, of course, dig for treasure. And I'll get some 150 coins. <laughs> be all grinny. Gotta be all sneaky thiefy. But don't worry, Mr. Gambler. I'm coming for you. It might take a little longer than anticipated, but I will get you. Alright, so where are we going? Well, I guess we're going to the cop, because I don't want to spend that much time. The fly swatter seems nice. Ooh, it really does seem nice. But we're going to use it to get down here to the copper. We're going to say, no, we're not going to pay the bribe. If we go to jail, it might mess things up. Not a big deal, though. So we need a two to get the coins here. And then we'll just hop over there. Oh, another one of these permanents, man. Oh, that's a nice safety card. If I get a misfortune, you can do it. Okay, I'm going to go here. I could go here, just kind of jump the whole thing. Ooh, that's even nicer. Okay, we're going to go here. We're going to use this. Get our, two, our coins. 60 coins. Thank you. Election. Five turns. I'm not going to win this election. And it looks like Mr. Six Points down the bottom, the banker, is going to... Ooh, and he's got six points now, too. Well, hopefully somebody takes care of one of them, and I can take care of the other guy. Holding on to that, these cards can be dangerous. If you get caught with them, you go to jail. But as I've already explained, I want to go to jail. <laughs> so I'm willing to risk it. So what are you going to use to get up there? 
Man, all these nice cards here. I want to go get these points. They're really easy to get. Alright, so we're going to use the Lucky Potion to get up there. We're going to pay our dividend, or get our dividends. I will increase my thing to 40. Okay. That was people making out. Anyone going up? He made a little progress. Not too bad. Now, what's our next move? One, two, three, four. Or one, two, three, four, five. What do we got? We got a four. It's five, five. You know, I'll use this one to move, but he's a permanent. When any player, including you, sells, on, no, nobody's doing that. Oh, maybe they are. I don't know how desperate people are. Nice. Stealing money from each other. All right. Oh, I want this card to play. But we're going to play this down here. I'm going to use you. Oh, I say we're going to use this one. Nope. All right. Bring me up to 11 points. Now, I might make the circle around again. Choose a misfortune your opponent gets. Pay two of those or get whatever. Whose turn is it? Well, he doesn't have anything there. Pay 80 or lose three. There. Pay 80 coins. You got too many coins? Coughing up. Man, I keep getting these nice coins. I want to go back up there now. If I hit here, the problem with here is you lose all your cards. And I've got some really tight cards. And playing for the jail in this one is probably not the best way to go. My best way to go is just to get this done. All right, I don't have any reason to go for here. Um, oh, he's for a different area. Maybe I can make some coins. Uh, let's go this way. Or this way. Yeah, go that way. No, we don't pay. Never going to pay. Unless I'm desperate not to go to jail. Man, I need more coins. Nope, that's not acceptable. That's 11 points. He's tied with me. Oh, but man. If I can get back around, one, two, three, four, five. Do I have a five? I do have a five. Uh, I gotta pay it. So close. That was a sweet move. Nice. <laughs> sweet. Uh, I'm going to jail. All right. Going to jail. <laughs> oh, no. I didn't go to jail. That's nice. But what did I lose? Oh, the horror. All right. So what happens here? Teleport to the court or to the office. Do I have any reason to go to either one of those places? No, but I need coins now. I need them like nobody's missing. Oh, it's too bad, man. I would love to have tried. So I don't really have anything I can use right now except for the dirigible, and that'll take me to the court. Um, it's rough. I'm going to go... Let's go here. Let's just roll the three. Get ourselves moving. Uh, do we want to go anywhere?
No, I don't really care about that. No. All right, he won the election. It would have been mean of me to steal it from him, but I don't think I could have stole it from him anyway. Oh, Mr. Governor. The governor doesn't have to pay any of these things. And the cops don't try and stop. Which is great when you got really high malice. But at least I'm not the highest on the board. Alright, where do we want to go? We want to get out of here. So we're going to use our... That's not a lot of points. And I feel I should keep it. Can I roll a 1? Is it 1 not possible? Uh... Let's take uh, this one. No, nah, I don't care about misfortunes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh, and I got a misfortune. Teleport to the Inferno. Okay. Uh, what cards can I play here? I don't have any cards. Oh, I got these cards. Sacrifice. Oh, rough. I just sacrificed my permanent card to make some points. Get 100 coins and throw away all my cards. I forgot about this, the Inferno deck. <laughs> it's like, what card can I play? I'm... 19 out of 30 points, boys and girls. 19 out of 30 points. That misfortune was such a misfortune. All right, so what do we got? We got a one here. Ooh, that's seven points. That's nice. We might head over there. I don't have any cash. Where are our points going to come from at this point? This guy here. Holy jumping if I can get a thousand. That would overkill it. Um, so where do I go? Well. I don't really have anything to do. So we're going to go this way. And we'll use... I'll just use him to go. Take me a little longer. Oh! What a surprise! <laughs> <Pretty much. laughs> that was funny. <laughs> I need more moats, man. <laughs> Sorry for any loud noises you just heard there. My headset fell off my head when I went to go scratch my head. All right, now, I want to come here. Now, what do I got that'll bring me there? Well, this pittance will bring me there. Everybody dance now. Ooh, yeah, we'll gamble. Why not? What's the risk? Oh, we made some coin. I don't really know what I just did. All right. Oh yeah, I got seven points. And I'm still not in the lead for elections because we're tied for votes now, but when it comes down to a tiebreaker, it's whoever's got the least malice. But we're gonna get over here. We're gonna try and get our coins. We need 500 coins to play this big boy. This guy, next to nothing. All right, so we're gonna go, well gee golly, let's go this way if we can. I don't even know which way we're going. We're just going to go. No bribes for me, please. We still need money, though. I need so much money. Oh, see. I might do that and take the lead on the elections. Let's have a look. Oh, well, he's got a secret card there. Throw that out. Ciao. Adios, amigos. What you got to play there? False testimony. Nice. Hmm. Well, that's okay. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> so 
for anyone else in the jail with me? Yeah, that'll work. I'll take that. Tied for the most hated, but he took my points, but it's only fair. Damn it. <laughs> we got a chance to make some more coins, get our points, build our rep up. It's still early. I'm still in the lead. Oh, we've been half an hour into the game so far. It's not too bad. This game can go a while. I've seen it go up to two hours, like the last time I tried to do it, over two hours. Well, I think I'll be nasty in jail. Let's see what our traps are. Gamble at the rep. No, thank you. I don't even think that works. Well, yeah, we're going to take the money again. Yeah, why not? We'll just keep taking cash. That's what it's all about. Do I have a one? No. I was hoping I had a one. Then I could land on this. But whatever. We need the monies, honey. I uh, guess what? I ain't gotten anything bad, man. Too bad. If you could send me back to jail, that'd be okay. One more turn, and I will be the next level up. Yeah, that'll do. Right where I want to go. Now look at them racking up the points. Five points over there. Look at him go. He's a little behind the times there. He really is living up to his character. Except for he's rich as hell. <laughs> the popper. All right, well, we're out of the jail now. So where are we going to go? Well, what are, are we risking here? Ugh, I don't want that. So, we'll go here. I'm not using that. So, what options do I have? Ooh, well, that's gross. Um, I guess we're just going to go with this. Oh, you pick for me. Come on, Mr. Papa. Big. What's my misfortune going to be? Pay 100 or get... Yeah, I'll take the, the ding to that. All right. Not taking my money, man. I need my monies. I need all the monies I can get. Because so i got to try and make it out of here. I have no votes anymore. Damn, man. Look at him. He caught right up. Come out of nowhere. But he got all that cash. It was bound to happen. I want to get that automatic banker plate down. That would be so sweet. Um, but we can't go that way. So. Can we get anything from any of these things? No, we're just going to go here. No, here. Alright, just roll one of these goddamn cards and go. Uh, operate. I don't know what that helped him out or hurt him, but I figure I'll make him throw out some cards so I can get him cash. He doesn't need any more help, and I lost a freaking point. All right. This is where it's going to be tough for me, because my bribe out is 41. I don't have anything bad, so sorry guys. But I'm never gonna get my 500 coins. All right. About 50 coins if I use it. But I don't have anything I can use. I want to go here. I don't have a one. See, I want that. But how do I get there? Buy a 
insurance. One, uh... Here, let's go. Yeah, take the automatic banker. I know you want to. Just take it. Really, he didn't take it? Well, he gave me the criminal card. Nice. All right, so... Interesting. Well, I'm not going to be able to use that card. I'm just going to take it to move. Give myself a little coinage. It'd be nice if I could use both cards back to back. Look, I got another high point one there, too. All right. Let's see what we can do. No point going up here. Two, three, four. Mm -hmm. What do we got? Six. Oh, I'd lose a vote if I use that to move. Well, I ain't gonna get the 500 coins anytime soon, so we're gonna use these big movers to get moving. And I mean, I'll get 40 coins. Um, could get in here if I really want to, but we're going to go here. If I had another plant card, it'd be great. choices right now. They don't look good, so I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven to get down here. I can use a three to get to the copper. Uh, what do we got? A three here somewhere, right? sure what happened there. I told him to get arrested. And he didn't get arrested. He went to here. Oh, he's got the ability. What is that ability? Damn it. All right. <laughs> Oops. Well, you know, can't remember all the stuff here. Well, it's my go. Now, what do we have? Anything to go down here for with? Nope. We do want to go here, and who's going to get us there? I'm going to say the secret passage. Ooh, that's a nice card to keep. Um, but it probably won't matter. Let's use it to get down here. We'll get our coins. Yeah, we'll dig through the dump. There's nothing to lose. So we're back up tied for first again. Oh, is it my turn again? Oh, well, look at this. Uh, can we play that? I guess we're going to have to go here if we can. Uh, there we go. I suppose I could have gone upwards. Yeah, I'm not playing any bidding games. Oh, now I don't have any 500-point cards. Oh, this thing, man. This thing. We need to come back around over to here. we got the coins, but we're going to lose a lot to do that. That's a big risk. We got a big mover. All right. Well, we can 
get here with a two. Alright, we're going up this way. I'm going to use that to get there. Oh, I'm not paying the 42. If I go to jail, I go to jail. How many times do I have to repeat myself? Every time I land, I guess. <laughs> the goal now is to get over to here and steal two points from this mother. And uh, then go work on getting some points. So I'll get three points in that. That will bring me up to 20. Bring him back down to 18. I only need a three to get there. And Mr. Knickknack, you could be the one that gets me there. But I think I will use this one to get there. Why would I do that? All right. Of course, that would screw him over too, just not as... Ooh. But I'm going to take the guy with the most money. All right, we're going to go here. We're going to use this to get there. Pay some money. Whatever. Oh, I don't have the three votes. Uh, and he's only got that, so we're gonna pick him. He's gonna go dump. I don't care. Let's get back to the dump. No. I wish I'd realized I didn't have the points to play that damn card. I wouldn't have bothered going here. That happens sometimes. I'll miss the stupid little payments. Like, oh, there's no coins up there, and I don't even notice my eyes just look for the coin payments, right? That's a nice one. I don't even have the money to pay this anymore. It's all good. We'll figure it out. Really upsetting. All right. Can we get here? What happens if I use that? Skip your next turn if you use this card to move. Yeah. I don't want to skip my turn. All right. So we're going to go here and we'll pay the two points. Oh. My points. What the hell happened to my. Ooh, the buddy stole my points. I didn't even pay attention. Look, he's just like. All right. This is worth trying to get in there for. And it's worth the six points and missing a turn for. One, two, three, four, five, six. I had to land here. Oh, you're going to play a big one, aren't you? All right. Nice. Alright. Oh, I'm down at the bottom now. However do I do it? We use this next time. We'll get our six points. Whatever. And then we'll start participating in player conflicts, maybe. Six points. Did I say six points? I meant five points. I'm going to make myself broke as heck doing this. I would never use that unless I really need to put somebody in jail. This is a cutthroat game. It's pretty close. Probably one of the closest games I've ever seen. Oh, he's taking his bribes. Every time we pay a bribe, they go up here, and then he gets to take it back. He doesn't have to worry about it. Now me, I'm going to skip a turn. He's going to have all these things he can take if he wants to gain all that hate. And he's got a lot of hate he can gain without going past either one of us. But that, as long as he's going to stay governor, he's got really no risk in taking them. So, 
Oh, this is a nice one. That's the win right there. If I can get 500 coins and get up and around. Look, he's taking all of his malice and all of his coins. Every player passes two cards to the player in the next round. Well, you know what? I don't want to give that away. I'm going to keep this because I want a little coin. It's not going to do that. Ooh, these are both nice ones. I'm not giving you any of these. Here, snitch and uh, promotion. Have fun. What did I get? Lucky potions. Gosh darn. How lucky for me. Two disposable moving cards. So if I can get a one, do I have a one? No, I don't. Okay. What's the next misfortune? Minus two. Well, I can live with that. Um, where are we going? Oh, I need 350. I'm never going to get 350 that way. Uh, yeah, I really don't know where I'm going with this. I don't want to land on the misfortune. I'm never going to save up that much money. I don't think I'm going to use either one of these. So I can play that and get down to here. Get some cash. Oh no! I lost the two things I didn't have! 27 points. Oh. 27 points. Man. That's dangerous. Somebody do something. I can't do anything right now. Uh, he's gone through so many points in this game. It's not funny. Come on. I gotta come in at least second. First is the goal, but first and second you get some points in the rankings, right? Even 300 coins. I would take 300 coins. I need coins, man. I play a risky style this time. Trying not to get the coins, but... Uh, getting all this malice. Come on, dude. Ugh. We need to deal with this guy. Um, I guess I'm going to go... don't have anything there, so we're going to move the four points and go visit him. Oh, I'm going to bid two. Oh, no, I went to jail. And I get a point. turns in five turns in jail and the elections go and guess what the banker is still the governor Ooh, ouch is he getting points every turn now does he have something going on there what's he got he's got all these things going on gambling get what's each time 30 every player except for you loses one of these every six rounds that is rough man all right we got to get rid of that permit. What's this one here? What are you looking at, dude? I got a secret thing here. All right. Ouch. Where are you going? He's going to win the game. was a weird set of instinct. I should have taken the money. <laughs> I'm not going to be close enough to make any points out of this anytime soon. The game will be over unless somebody can knock him down a peg or ten. And I'm going to come in third place because I'm not going to get another point. If I can even get up there and use this, um, anything that gives me a point would be great right now. That's the only one I got that I can get a point off. I can't even use this. I need to get out, maybe. <sighs> be had behavior, whatever. Yeah, that'll do. I'll take that. It's 
Sticking in the jail right now is probably a bad idea, but I don't know what to do, man. I mean, I'm in the jail. Oh, I could come in last place here. Ouch, I am now in last place. Somehow I'm getting some street cred too with the elections. What is he going for? Where is he going to make his point? I can't even catch up to last place or second last place now. I can't get in second place unless there's a miracle happens. Guys, what are we gonna do about this banker? He's gonna win. It was a good game. Even if I lost, it was a good game. It's probably one of the closest up and down games I've played in a while. I mean, the poverty just come out of nowhere. These other two have been constantly a pain in the ass. But uh, I'm sure I haven't been much better. But I'm sticking with it. No thanks. Uh, yeah, let's go free. I know. It doesn't do me any good right now. And everyone lost a point. 29. Look at him go, eh? Is it he the one that's stealing everyone's coins? No, I don't know what happened there. He must have used a... Oh, he must use the thing where he stole coins for everyone, which is okay. I don't mind that. It prolongs the game a little bit. All right. Where am I going with this? Who knows? Um, I think I'm going that way, but we're not using that card. Let me just go here. We got two. Yeah, let's just go two. No, I don't care. I'm not gambling. <laughs> Gotta get, get out of here. Need points. Points, points, points. If I find someone poorer than me, that guy's poorer than me, and I can outbid him. But he's going the wrong bloody way. Oh, I got 50 coins. And damn. Damn, man. How am I going to get out of this hole I'm in? And he wins. Congratulations. Good game, man. All right, rank my own performance. I'm gonna say it was great, and you all did amazing. Would I recommend them all? 100%. And that's defense. I can't pronounce Ganga. Nice guys. That was a beautiful round, and it only took us 54 minutes, half the time it took me last time to play one of these games. So that's episode two of Board Games with Sefton. If you like any of the board games I'm playing and you want to play games with me, just let me know. Make sure you add me on, uh, what do we call that there? Uh, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, <laughs> add me on Steam, which you'll find me as Sefton on Steam. I believe the icon we'd be looking at is uh, not that one there, but this one here, 
should look something like that on my Steam. Let me just double check that for you because I haven't looked at my Steam in like for ages. All right, so we go to Sefton, and yes, that's my icon. So if you see this one here, and I'll make it a little bigger. If you see this on Steam, that is me. Feel free to add me and just indicate that you're uh, interested. Um, I also have a Discord channel you can join up um, once you add any on Steam. Just say, hey, I watched you play board games. So I'd like to play some board games with you online, and we'll do that. I also have uh, some other board games to play, including Tabletop Simulator, which I haven't gotten into. I'd really like to, but it's frustrated me to no, no man trying to understand how to use it properly. So, at some point. Anyway, thanks for watching, everyone, and have a good day.